Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Creeper World Report. That is right, we are back yet again in the colony section. Yet again for an LPAC cursor map. It's a, it's a cursor map, but it is also an LPAC map. Uh, it's LPAC cursor shaper again. Or cursor? With no R. Um, yeah, there you go. Uh, may lag on weak devices. Mod installed LPAC pack cursor C shaper. Let's give it a go. That being said, this is a, you know, it's a, it's a, it seems like a longer one. Uh, there is a lot to it, as you can see. So basically, this is the map. There's a whole lot going on on the map. I'm not really worried about the map itself. Uh, there is this nullified over here. The only thing unnullified is a zero emitter. So we, we can't do anything until we get a boost, period. Flat out, we can't do anything until we get a boost. That being said, I am going to give myself a limitation. Because once this starts spawning, you can just drop an egg over here and get out. Right? You can get out and be done with it. So I'm not going to allow myself to exit this quadrant until pretty much this quadrant is defeated. That being said, defeated means nothing has power. You know, basically we're able to kill everything inside. So once everything in here is defeated, we will then be allowed out. And we can even egg out. It doesn't matter how we get out. We can get out via this little path or, you know, you know just egging over here or something doesn't matter at that point so that's my one stipulation is i do want to kill this area first and then go out because again you can just egg over to this and just sort of beef this up and take over the map and all sorts of stuff and, and i think that's out of the out of the spirit of the map so let's get the show on the road we will need to of course realistically just wait a lot of time now i don't see the problem is if i go to times four speed it's one second one second one second times four speed basically the same it's because of the lag right it's just one eh, it's a little bit faster times two speed honestly i think times two might be a little bit faster I'm not a hundred percent sure which is the fastest speed again our goal right now is just to sort of build this up i want to build this up we do have a cursor so we're gonna sort of cursor up this because this is where we have our things now we do have the problem of of course there there's all of this bad stuff so we you know we're not in the best of places right now and we will want to beef this up but i mean realistically this emitter doesn't really matter that much right i mean realistically I mean, even if even if we took all of this, I mean, it'd have to go through this tiny hole, through that tiny hole, through that tiny hole, through that tiny hole to go around, through Bertha's destroying everything to get out here. So this emitter, I want to I want to put some points in just to just to get it going, but it's really not that good of an emitter. I mean, or it's not going to be good long term. So I don't want to put too many points into it. Maybe like five or six, you know, just just enough to get it going, but. Yeah, it's, it's not where our heart will lie, so to speak. Uh, I, I do want it to have enough to be able to fill this area out, get through these shields. As you can see, this AC is insane. I, I don't understand how these sprayers have sprayed that much. I mean, they've sprayed an insane amount. So those sprayers are going ridiculous. We might as well keep our cursor over stashes, I suppose. Maybe, maybe some of these. I will be egging that most likely. But for now, for now, we're still, we're still riding the chain. And ooh, are those? Okay, we're so, we're, we're actually, ooh, we're actually getting towards this. Oh no, sprayer! Oh, the sprayers over here are shooting. All right, so we're gonna egg you on this a little bit, right? Just a little bit, not too much, just enough to hopefully get some destruction. Because, yeah, let's get rid of the lasers. No more lasers. Not too bad. I took a couple eggs. I don't want to use it too many, realistically. Is that? Okay, that's 100. I feel 100 is pretty good. Again, we can use our cursor, because it is a cursor map. You know, we can, we can cursor up here. It's beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. The cursor is cursoring. It's amazing. And my goal will be to take out this area next. It, I mean, it's not... It, it is a jump. It is a jump over a wall. But it is also connected to the main area, right? It's connected to the main area, and I feel pretty good about that. 
So, my goal is to actually just drop like an egg. Ooh. Can, can that pop that egg? No, it can't. It can't pop the egg. Interesting. Okay, so this egg has to be here. This one will get deleted. Whoops, there's there. There we go, because I want this um, M-Rift gown. Get rid of that. Ooh, that Bertha came at just the right time and kind of kind of hindered us a little bit. Want to want to get some power? This power gone, if I can. That'd be great. You know, doesn't need I don't need all of it gone, but just a little bit. Just a little bit of that power gone. Feels pretty good. And now if we can get this one other M rift. So like right here. If we can just sort of leap uh -huh, boom. All right, that feels pretty good. So now if we were to take out these Boom. Boom. There we go. No more power. That feels super good. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Now, I'm not going all the way out. I am I am using the uh, little the little hallway here just to destroy some towers. Just to destroy some towers. Nothing nothing too important, but the key here is we have taken out the power. And that's what's important, right? So now we can start moving our butt, right? We're going to do essentially a reverse assault on the base. A reverse assault. So, these shields are quite annoying. Whoa, I almost lost my creep. Uh, I'm, I'm just sort of going through this whole area just to sort of get things to fire and waste their ammo. Because, you know, I mean, the ammo is there to be wasted. Uh, of course, I wholeheartedly uh, was a fool and whoa oh man this this goes fast oh we're on times two speed right, right. you know let's go to times one speed because we're on we're on assault mode now right so i, I do want to waste all of the ammo in here just because you know it's there it's there right i mean there's ammo to be wasted we might as well just end it no more ammo for you everyone's happy but let's be real and what do we want here we want to cut off power that's what whoa Whoa! Units, they shoot very hard, very fast, very cool. You know, sometimes you gotta respect it. You have to respect a unit that can actually take out what you're trying to do. Right? So, our goal right here is to keep... Ooh. Oh, we gotta move slow. Ooh. Okay, so the commands are doing great. And we were able to avoid the Bertha shot. So let's get this M Rift, ideally. If we can get this M Rift, I feel like we're gonna. <gasps> the M Rift didn't die. Oh no, and they got power back. What am I doing? What am I doing? No! All we need is creep to stay in this side. Come on. Come Oh, okay. They, they got a lot of stuff shooting over there. Fair enough. Fair enough. That's understandable. But again, realistically, what we need is to take out MRIFs. That's all we need right now. Uh, we just need to get out of here, right? Again, the goal is to make it so our unit itself there. Oh, wow. Okay. This is actually pretty good for holding creep. Ah, see, that's the problem. So that's what we need. We need a little bit more up here. Let's just drain these out. Keep this area filled because clearly they like to... Oh, oh my God. They kill that so fast. How I am amazed at how much power they have. That blows my mind. But I did see the Bertha shot come through. So I do want to go for it. Yeah, no, it's too much. It is too much for us currently. That being said, I do want to get rid of these lasers and keep moving, right? We don't want to, we don't want to dilly dally, so to speak. So thankfully, we can take out that emerald at least, and that does lead us to this area, which should hopefully, yeah, these em these mortars are not enough to take us out, which means we'll be able to take out another emerald, which is great. And a, uh, a laser. And I don't like the laser. Oh. One second. Warp. And back. There we go. 
just to make sure they don't gain that power back, right? We, we just need to get through, get the laser down. Beautiful. Get that down. Get this emrif down. Happy times. And, yep, yeah, very happy times, right? Okay, so we've actually cut off power to this area, at least. So we've cut off power to one area. Uh, these should run out of power very quickly, very easily. And then we should actually, actually, if we just come up here and just go here, we should be able to cut off power to this area. So we're able to start cutting off power in places, which is grand, right? Boom. Power cut off. They're going to run out. Happy times. Again, we are limiting ourselves. We don't necessarily have to in any regard, but we are because we want to be fair to the map. You know, the map wants us to be fair, I think. I, mean, I don't really know. I mean, the map probably doesn't care, per se. But, whoa, wow, look at that. They do such a good job of taking us out. Uh, let's get rid of these mortars, because, you know what? These mortars are the only thing that's actually hurting us right now. Bazinga, bazanga, all the mortars are gone. And, yeah, feels pretty good. So this is technically free, which is great. We have loads of things built up, which is also great. I do... Oh. I see. I see what you're trying to do. And I approve of what you're trying to do. I just will not allow you to do it. So if we can get this one MRIF down. Which it looks like we're more powerful now than we were before. Boom, there we go. We got the Emrift. Happy times. There is now no more power other than coming from this one Emrift. So if we can actually destroy it with rocks. Boom! There is now no more power in this entire sector. So technically the sector is beaten. Might not, you know, it might not seem like it, because there's still things alive. However, Nothing alive can get power, period. There's no way to get power other than through this one avenue. And we have control of that entire avenue. Like, we can come down here. Like, we're doing it right now. Uh, we'll come from this direction as well. You know, we'll, we'll just spread this around because we can. And, oh, look, they're all out of power. Huzzah! Happy times are here again. Oh, so many units are dying. Oh, it's just what you want to see. Uh, all of the, uh, all of those shields are going down. And I think this is technically what I would consider a defeat of this area. So I feel like we have defeated the area. We're able to destroy everything. Technically speaking, we're able to destroy this. But if we take a quick look, I mean, that's a lot of AC. I don't want to go through that right we, maybe we will eventually, but right now I'm okay with this just sort of being there. They lost, but they have a bastion. We'll, t we'll take it eventually. So I think we're okay to exit. And I think that's the get well, right? We're actually able to exit now. And that's what's actually important. So do we have the capability of actually exiting is the question. And it looks like we do have the power. So it looks like we have enough power that we are able to get through the massive amount of earned commands. So I think that is viable for us to exit, which also means we're able to just beef this bad boy up and have a unit on the outside. Bazinga bazinga, we now have a 380 emitter on the outside. I am very happy for that. And now we're able to just keep progressing right let's let's get this actual show on the road there we go let's let's get you down nobody likes you nobody likes you get out of here m rift oh jeez nobody likes m rifts nobody likes m rifts m rifts are always like the biggest jerks at the party you know they're always thinking they're so hoity-toity and all of that stuff but there you go there goes the power to this side and yeah, they are out of power now. So just a, just a little bit of creep this way, a little bit of the creep this way, a little bit this way. And just happy times. Just happy times. We didn't need to kill them because they were out of power. 
We chose to kill them. <laughs> and now our cursor is actually... Ooh, are we... Uh, you know, maybe we need to go along the edge, unfortunately. We're not strong enough to take out the main section. However, we are strong enough to take out the rest. And our goal now, again, just like before, is to take out the power, right? So, you know, just do a little sweep around. Maybe we'll come up here and free this spore launcher. Sure, might as well. Take out a couple of these. That feels pretty good. There is an MRF here. I do want to take out. I don't. Do we have the power? Ooh. And I'm not sure if we have the power to take that out just yet. We might have the power to take that out. But we might have to just, you know, do it in a wise way. Slowly. Slowly. Oh, yes. I think as long as we do it slow, they can't actually take care of us. So, as long as we can get that M-Rift. Oh my gosh, I'm such a fool. What am I doing? I'm supposed to have the uh, boop, 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 boop. map indicator. And I guess I should be top down. Because we're doing cursor things. One, two, three. Beautiful. So now we have cut off power to the main threat. Oh no. The main threat has lost its power. And there really isn't anything they can do about it. I mean, what are they going to do? So what are we going to do? We're going to keep cutting off power. Emrift, right here. Gone. It's It's, it's got to go. Easy days. What's the next Emrift? Where's power coming from? It looks like it's coming from a box over here. Yeah, box, get out of here. Nobody likes you. Nobody likes boxes. Nobody likes boxes. Like, that's that's just a given. Uh, so up here, where is the power coming from? It looks like it's all coming from this MRF. So there isn't an MRF on the top side of the map, it looks like. Which is pretty sad. Uh, pretty sad when you think about it, right? Yeah, power is coming out of the base right now. So if we can sort of cut this off, I think we can cut off most of the map. Like, that would be pretty amazing, if you ask me. And our cursor is quite strong at the moment. So, there we go. We have cut off most of the map already. That's amazing. Right? Amazing. Plus, we have three more points, and we're going to put it over here. Because, of course, this is the more important one. This one is still trapped by that, unfortunately. Uh, but it is what it is, you know. We got we got to deal with what we got to deal with. We got to go with what we got to go with. And you know, let's kill some Berthas. Nobody likes Berthas. They're they're kind of jerks at this point in time. So if we can get rid of you, get rid of oh my gosh. Ooh. <laughs> I will say they have an obscene amount of defenses. Uh, their defenses are pretty ridiculous, and I do think we need the entire map to be flooded in order to make our actual stand. So, you know, we have some work to do. Ooh, that did cut off this entire section. Beautiful, beautiful. So now we've cut off... Oh my gosh, they have no generation. Like, they don't even have energy in the base. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. So now... We have completely enswickled their base, which is great. Can we hold this here and survive? It looks like we can. They are super blowing us up, but we did take care of all of the Berthas, which is fine. Uh, we have creep flowing in. We might as well just let it go. Again, right now we're just trying to get land control. Because I believe... I mean, I'm assuming land control equals power, as in most maps. So if land control equals power, then we want to control as much as possible. So even this doesn't seem like much, but let's just take what we can, right? Slowly but surely. Yeah, we can take this. This, is, this isn't too bad. It seemed like there was so much AC here earlier, and now it's just fairly easy. So we've taken, we've taken the base. We've taken the map, per se, right? We've uh, ensoycled the base, which feels real good, right? We're not we're not going into, you know, destructo range at the moment, but we're we're taking things out when we can, 
Okay, so we actually have to take this with the cursor. Which is a little bit of a shame. I don't really... What is going on? Oh, jeez. That is shooting out egg spheres that are standing still and not doing anything. Great! Doesn't really help us. Doesn't really help us in the slightest, and that's okay. You know, we, we don't need it to always help. I wish that was targeting the base. That would be super cool. Maybe that was the, the goal. Like, hey, you get this, and then it'll start shooting eggs to the base, and it didn't quite work out. I don't know. I'm kind of hoping this will just win out now. You know, one, now that we've taken basically everything. I hope this wins it. Right? If it doesn't, well, we got more problems on. Uh, we want, again, just trying to get more land or more control. Right? So we're just gonna get all those gone. All of these easy days, right? Just an easy clap. Send it in. They'll shoot some stuff. They'll, they'll kill some creep and then they'll run out of ammo. It's just what they do. It's just what they do. There's not much that they can do against this reckless creep. And we are quite reckless indeed. Uh, I'm going to do seven more. Just, just to get that creep going. Because more creep is more good. And more good is more plentiful. Because we need the plentiful creep. We have 500 eggs on the map. So that's actually a problem. Right? So... Yeah, get out of here. Get out of here, Circle. I don't know if that affects me placing eggs, because I do want to place eggs eventually, right? <laughs> so, uh, if I, I'm not placing eggs yet. I guess it doesn't really, because I'm not placing eggs yet. That being said, we have 73 eggs to place, and that, that means we are going to try and fill this bad boy up. I do hope... Even at 500, we can still place our own eggs. Boom. You know what? Let's just go row by row. Easy days. Row by row. I want to... Ooh, that's a nice little line. Ooh. Oh, we're at our limit already? Oh, jeez. Okay, I was not expecting us to be at our limit already. That was my fault. Holy moly. So... It looks like we are able to hold. I'm going to go up here. Because it's sort of the furthest away. And I really want our creep to start winning out the day, right? If they get distracted by down here while we come up top, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that fact. Uh, we do have... Two more upgrades, so let's use those. Again, any creep that we can generate right now that will flow this direction. I mean, look at, like... Oh, wow. We actually did cause at least a wave coming this way. But we need creep over here, right? This is where we need creep. And unfortunately, all of this is never going to make it, right? Because, again, it has to go through here, to here, to here, to here, to here, out this way, and then around. Never going to make it. The only creep we can count on is from here. I guess if there were spores, that's fine. But I mean, look at the number of airships. Never, a, a single, a, a spore will never, you could send probably like 500 spores and they just won't make it. So we kind of are in a predicament to a degree, right? So uh, it is pretty much the cursor from here on out. We do need our cursor to do the dirty. And I do think being as far away from the actual air units as possible is beneficial. Because then we can do this sort of wrap around right there. Come on back to our dirty spot. And hopefully the creep will distract them. Whether it does or not, I don't know. There's 500,000 creep on this, or AC on this map. It's ridiculous. So we have to get through so much AC. Or we... Like, this map is a little bit ridiculous. Just a wee little bit. That being said, they're in a, a little bit of a deficit. I think if we just destroy, like, everything, right? If we, do, if we just get rid of stuff, just, just use a butt-ton of rocks, 
right? Just boom. I don't even care what I blew up. It doesn't even matter to me, right? Uh, yeah, I think that's pretty good because now they're in a much bigger deficit, right? So we can do a little bit of this action, a little bit of this action. Again, blow up some more stuff. Feels pretty good. And eggs. And eggs. So again, our goal right now is to drain this AC. And I don't know. Wait, is their factory full? How is their factory full? Oh, that's a 30 and that's a 30. How do they even have to lift deck? And how do these get power? I don't know where the power is coming from. I don't know where their lift deck is coming from. Interesting. That is... Interesting. I... Yeah, that's... It's it's something. Uh, something I don't understand. And that's okay. I don't have to understand everything. I just, I just have to sort of be... My goal is to exist... So our goal right now is just to see if we can start draining this AC. Ooh, wait, we are draining the AC. It is going down. It was 500,000, it's now 491. It's not going down fast, but any amount that's going down is a good sign. I do want to save up a few more eggs so we can hopefully egg towards the base. But maybe that's better when we drain more. Because we're forced... Yeah, we're, we're bringing it down. We've gone down almost 10% from when we first started. So I guess the AC is flowing out of the spot that our cursor is currently on. And we just sort of have to deal with that. Thankfully, a lot of the gunships are shooting to the right and to the south and things like that. So we are in a very good spot to drain the AC because we're not the spot that's getting shot, which is good. <laughs> you know, we're at 426, which is nice. Anything we drain, we're draining more and more. As you can also see, their deficit is monstrous, right? I'm gonna pause it and I'm gonna add five more to our emitter over here. Because again, there is no point adding it to the spores even, and again chances are my guess is that's probably a random spore that would be my guess that's going to be a random spore so we just want as much creep to flow over here as possible so it is as big of a distraction as possible we can actually see our cursor is creating a a, a creep pylon whatever you want to call it nearly as big as uh what you would expect and if we can get in here right like say we can actually destroy this m rift for instance right we can then drop rocks inside of the base oh no they're all shooting me oh no so my goal with these rocks is just to destroy any sprayers oh my gosh so they're able to hit us but not kill us so that's actually good like we're on the inside they are super shooting us all of the edges are actually being pressured which will release ac but that ac will die it looks like the sprayers are supercharged to a degree Whatever that degree is. Uh, boop. Can I put any rocks down there? I would love to get rid of all of the sprayers. That's kind of my goal right now. And it doesn't look like we can necessarily do it, but the AC is down to 300,000. This is taking its time. Much more time than I was expecting. So, I don't like that fact. But... We are draining it. It's almost at 50% of what it once was when we initially were starting. So there you go. Uh, the AC drain is real. Uh, they are shooting me pretty darn hard, though. It feels... I feel it. I feel it in my soul. 
feel it in my my loins, my gerns, whatever you want to whatever you want to call it. We can actually move slightly lower. Okay, get rid of the rest of the sprayers. Beautiful. Is that what we needed to uh, eliminate everything? Well, the AC is not necessarily dropping faster, but it is still dropping. Can we just go for the base? I guess we can, right? We're able to move against the wall. Slow and steady. And yeah, we're able to hit the base. Look at that. And realistically, we go a little bit lower. We should start popping eggs. But I don't know if those eggs will even spawn because we're at 500. Doesn't look like they're spawning. <laughs> so that that spore launcher actually hurt us more than it helped us. Um, did not expect that. That's okay, because we're down to 160k creep, we're at the base, it's going down, everyone's happy with this, I hope. I'm going to try and take out the factory too, because I don't, I don't know what's powering the ships. I don't, because I know some are powered by lift deck and, and such. There goes the factory, there goes the base, I want to see if the... F I just want this. I want to take out the entire area. I'm not going to lie. I would feel real bad if we didn't. So will that run out? And is the AC going to run? Or will those always fire? Are they like infinite ammo? Is that a thing that is possible? I didn't even know that was possible. So there, there goes the earn port. Happy days. Boom, there you go. Oh, this actually kills them. Yeah, let's, let's just blow them up. Get out of here. We're done with you. Oh, it's going to be so satisfying when they all die. Oh, you're all going to go. I know it. Boom. Oh, that their explosion caused such lag, too. That is per... Action. Ah, uh, there you go. Don't know what was giving them all the power. Maybe there were some boxes under them or something like that. But that has been an LPAC Kursu Shaper again. Very nice. Very nice. So how did we do with limitations? You know, again, I, I do think this map will be much easier just escaping right away. Uh, so we had the ability to escape right away. We did in 25 minutos. And 26, 27. Oh, do, do, do. I'm expecting like there's like a 10 or 19 or something. 18, there we go. So much faster time. But honestly, 2505 still darn good. <laughs> Holy moly. I think that's the second best time other than in the 18 minute one. I think we did pretty darn good. That feels awesome. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. There you go. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope you're doing wonderful and feeling great. You deserve it. And yeah, we will catch you next time. So please do take care.